Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. I'm continuing my playthrough of the SNES classic, The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past, and now return you to the next episode, currently in progress. Awesomeness awaits. And we're back. We're getting ready to make our trek back up to the northeast again. Now that we got the power glove, we can lift the stone that'll let us go behind the magic shop and pick up an item we're going to need down to the southeast. I, I hate all the backtracking, but I mean, the map's only but so big. Oh, come on. <laughs> any, uh, any other bombs? Okay. <laughs> yes, I know, I know. I'm still collecting, uh... Alright. I need to, to the right, and then up. And then keep going up. I could use some more bombs, though. I probably ought not buy them unless I get desperately, desperately low. One of the nice things is that uh, one of the locations we're looking for should uh, should allow us to expand our capacity for bombs and arrows. It costs rupees to do that, though. Which is why I've been trying to obsessively collect rupees and forgetting that... Uh, <laughs> because old game design reasons, you can only collect 999 rupees, and then you cap out. No? Okay. Anyway, we need to head down this way. I don't know why I keep trying. Now, we can lift this guy, which opens up this area. Alright, let's deal with him. Alright, there's usually something. Oh. It helps if you hit the right button. Ah, uh, the waterfall of wishing is just around the corner. Is it now? No, okay, I thought there was something there for some reason. Don't move. Come on, you buzzard. Ah. I'll take the heart. Fine. Alright, what I needed to do is... Oh, no, oh, not you. Uh... Ow. I'm not going to be able to do that until I do the next thing. Okay. I was hoping to do that cave first, but not going to happen. All right. Oh, these guys. Ah, that was. Ooh. And we're not going to be able to do that anytime soon. Ow! Come on. For serious. Alright. There we go. Come on. 
better sword. Alright, I need to... Oh, that's not it. Oh, come on. No, no, no. Crikey, I don't need you people doing that to me. I don't need to keep falling into the stupid water either. Nope. Dead end. Come on. Nope. No! There we go. This is what I needed. Hello. What? What do you want, little man? Do you have something to ask me? <laughs> I want the flippers. I just dropped by. I want the flippies. But I don't give flippers away for free. I sell them for 500 rupees a pair. Yeah, no, it is 500, not 400. Well, there he goes. Half my earnings. One pair of flippers coming up. I will give you a free bonus with your purchase. I will let you use the magic waterways of the sea folk, which link lakes and rivers. When you see a whirlpool, dive into it. You never know where you'll surface. You bought Zora's flippers. With these, you should be able to swim even in deep water. Now I will stop losing hearts going through the deep water. Uh, oh, and not all whirlpools are passages. Some of them are just those guys coming to surface. So uh, do be mindful of that. And swimming is slow. We will eventually get to where we can get that heart. Actually, I might be able to do that now, now that I think about it. I just need to find where the next way up is. Hi, friend. Mm. Or, or maybe that was one of those ones that I don't... I don't get access to until I can start making my way between the late world and the dark world. Because I, I know that is a thing, too. Uh, I'll take it as one of those things that I can't do just yet. What I can do just yet is go back to the Waterfall of Wishing over here. Because we're going to have a little bit of fun with this. Mysterious Pond. Won't you throw something in? What will you do? Throw an item. Select an item using the control pad and throw it using the Y button. Now, most things will be returned to you. But if you throw an empty bottle, you'll get a magic potion. If you throw your boomerang, hello, pretty lady. Hello there. Did you drop this? Yes, I did. I like an honest person. I will give you something better in return. Now I got a magical boomerang. You can throw it faster and further than the old one. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, 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 that's just sad. That's unfortunate. So, empty bottle gets you a magic potion. Boomerang gets you the magic boomerang. And... Uh, let me just double check. Yeah. Where's my shield? Shield. 
Hello there, did you drop this? Yes I did. I like an honest person. I will give you something better in return. Hey! Your shield is improved. Now you can defend yourself against fireballs! Hot diggity. So all those fireballs the water people keep shooting at me. Uh, so the boomerang, the shield, and the green magic potion are the only things that get upgraded. Everything else will get returned to you. Do answer the question honestly. Don't uh, answer it honestly. Um, have I mentioned answer it honestly? Answer it honestly. Okay. What I can't remember is on your way back out. Oh, okay. We are supposed to be able to get that uh, that piece of heart now. I, I, I swear I can't read my own notes. Let's uh, let's do that because uh, I definitely definitely want. All those pieces of heart. I need all those pieces of heart. Hmm. Well, that takes care of my missing bomb. And this is one of those. That's the waterfall on the other side. There's supposed to be a bit of land over here that I can get up. Huh? Oh, for crying out loud. And the worst part is I can't can't check my notes. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, okay. I need to go over this waterfall. There we go. Those are the waterfalls from the other trip. This is where I can go in, claim my piece of heart. My one quarter hurt. <laughs> there are some who would contend I only have a quarter of a heart. Ooh, eight bombs. That would have been nice if I had been able to increase my capacity, yeah? Huh? Alright. Now we're done here. We got the heart, we got the flippies, we got the shield, we got the boomerang. Uh, what is next on our side quest? We need to get to the lake. Uh, because that is where we find the Fountain of Happiness, which is where we can buy the capacity to carry more stuff, and it's where we can pick up a third glass bottle. And there's a couple other things we can get to. But first things first. We need to we need to actually get all the way back down there again. Uh, oh, and we needed the flippies to get another uh, pair of uh, piece of heart. So after trekking from the lake all the way up here, guess what we get to do? trek from all the way up here back down to the lake. Oh, come on, people. This... This is not helping any of us. Oh, and I will definitely need all... Oh! Are you kidding me? I need to go capture another fairy. <laughs> and there, there's the piece of heart I needed. Yeah. You can kill those guys. It just takes arrows. And I don't want to... 
you know, let's do it. Fine. Oh, <laughs> this is why I don't do that more often. For some reason, I thought, uh... Ooh, that would have been nice. Alright, let's just keep stunning them. They're, they're, they're not worth it. Not worth it. Uh, oh! Oh, no! Oh. I will take your money, though. I'm down to a mere 502 uh, rupees. And I don't think I'm going to be able to get back there until I get the next level of glove, which will let me uh, open those guys up. Hey, uh, Mr. Free Sample. You still got another free sample? There we go. I like samples. Ah. stand somewhere else. <sighs> Nothing. Nothing. Oh, that's the problem with the boomerang going further. It takes longer to get back. Ooh. Speaking of, uh, Berries. There we go. And that fills up both my bottles again. And now that I got the flippies, I can uh, start swimming through the waterways too, which makes a lot of this easier. Except for when there's rocks. Because <laughs> of course there are. I forgot about that. Gamma. Oh. Nothing. Nothing. <sighs> All right. Back. Back down. Yep. Back down. And... It's one of these bridges here. Don't mind me, guys. I mean, I should be beating you up for all your money. Ow. take those arrows. Alright, now I need to get them down this way to Lake Hylia. Nope. There's a lot going on over here, that's for sure. Alright. Uh, nope. This is the shop. Where I can buy hearts, bombs, and health potions. Oh, come on. There's the fortune teller that will uh, sometimes give you a sort of cryptic hint as to where you're supposed to go next. I'm going to jump in here. These islands has my piece of heart. Hmm, I don't remember how to get that piece of heart. Nope, 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 nope. nope. What 
was the secret of that? Maybe that was... Maybe that, uh... Losing my ever loving mind. Alright. What am I looking for? Uh that was that a heart? One of those whirlpools actually is a whirlpool. And this should be the fountain of happiness. Which is what I was looking for. I can't pick those up yet. This is what I was looking for. The Fountain of Happiness. This is where I can start spending the rupees. Throw some rupees in and your wishes will surely come true. Do you want to throw rupees? Throw a few. How many will you toss? 20. Your happiness has increased 20 rupees. <laughs> Today you will have good luck. Uh, okay. So it's at a hundred rupees that you'll get to boost it, and you can do this uh, fourteen times until you get a maximum of fifty bombs and seventy arrows. So you got to keep kind of coming back and forth, coming in, and throw a few in the pond of happiness. Sadly, you can only do it 20 at a time. Alright, so my happiness is 40. I may do the rest of this off screen, like during the downtime. I'll go collect a bunch of rupees and, um, what, a fountain of happiness? Or an increase in the number of bombs and arrows. Which one was yep? Yep, for the Fountain of Happiness? Throw a few. 20 rupees. Oh, a fountain. Yeah. My total happiness is 80. I'll do this once just to show how it works, and then uh, the rest of that I'll do off camera um, before next week. And I will take the time to earn the rupees and get myself up. Again, you will get your bomb capacity maximum to 50 and your arrow max capacity to 70. So you get to that, hundred ru that magical 100 rupee... And she asks, do you want to carry more bombs or do you want to carry more arrows? Right now, I would like to carry more bombs. <laughs> and, and yeah, you just kind of keep repeating that until you get the bombs and the arrows. It, the grand total is 1,400 rupees to get everything out of both of them. Oh, no, no, no. Part of... With 70 arrows, I would be more likely to use them. Um... Where was I going next? Uh... The bridge? Okay. I already got the ice cave. I did that out of sequence. I need the bridge. Which means I need to swim through the waterway up uh, this way. Yes. No. <laughs> Don't mind me. Look out. Ah! <laughs> Hi, guys. Underneath that bridge is this Yahoo. Yo, you seem to be in a heap of trouble, but this is all I can give you. That's okay. 
Oh, yeah, and that's it. That's all he does. Just, you know, you head into the local vagrant. Can't pull his fire down or his tent down or the bridge down. No, you would like him even better if he was uh, fishing under the bridge. Oh, I was trying to avoid that. Oh yeah, I forgot. That will uh, get you to swim faster. What I can't remember. <laughs> yeah, maybe. I know maybe about it. What I can't remember is how to get up there. But I'm beginning to think that that is a, uh, that's a later thing. We don't do that just yet. Alright, let me get back on to dry land, if I can avoid these guys. Get ready to, uh, engage with these guys. Ow! Stupid buzzard. That's it for the fortune teller. Um, no. Oh, hang on, friend. I will absolutely be mugging you for your money. Every last one. Sadly, you guys don't carry that much. Of course, here's the problem. I was picking up all those rupees when I didn't need them. Now that I need them, not so much. Alright, let's uh, try our luck with this guy, shall we? Does he carry more? Hello, Beach Duck. No! Cheapskate. Oh, no. Maybe we won't, uh, try our luck with those guys. Nope. Oh! I almost forgot. Anything? I can pick up these guys now. And... Oh! Nothing useful. Okay. What I do need that it would be very useful is a couple of hearts. So... Oh. For serious. Hmm. Alright, there's one heart. Hi, friend. Let's get in here and replenish the rest of those hearts. And while I'm at home, <laughs> this might be a good time to take a very short break. Well, that was fun. And I hope you had fun too. Next episode should roll out tomorrow, unless tomorrow's a live stream day. Current schedule is over on my Twitch profile. There's a link in the description below. If you haven't already, follow me there. You'll get notified when I go live, and you'll be able to chat along as we record the next six episodes. You'll also be able to join along for some of the other stuff I do on Twitch. It's all up there on the channel. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel here. It really helps out. If you click the bell, you get notified of all the other stuff that goes up on the channel as well, like Coffee Craft Livestream Archives, Future Games Revisited Episodes, and uh, various other stuff that strikes my fancy. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, quips, queries, quotes, comments, complaints, or quibbles, leave them in the comments below. Have fun, enjoy, and I'll see you next time.